A felony drug charge being faced by a local man after allegedly selling a form of cannabis at a local CBD store. Brock Owens has an update in the case and reports officials saying it is a misconception that Delta 8 THC is legal. Last March, a man told law enforcement his two sons bought what they thought were CBD products from CBD of Altoona. But it turned out they were Delta 8 THC gummies, according to the criminal complaint. It says both were transported to the hospital for treatment. Delta 8 can be found naturally in cannabis plants, according to the National Institutes of Health, and can be considered hemp, which in 2018 was made legal by the Agriculture Improvement Act, or the Farm Bill leading many people to believe Delta-8 products are legal. But according to the NIH, Delta-8 is found in such small amounts in cannabis plants, leading to many products with Delta-8 in it being manufactured. That makes it a Scheduled One controlled substance in Pennsylvania, and according to a district attorney in the area, illegal without a medicinal card. The affidavit says the Attorney General's office investigated the incident at CBD of Altoona, and the former owner of the store, Thomas Bryan, Officials say a controlled purchase was made at the shop shortly after receiving the complaint last March and say the items bought testing positive for Delta-8 THC at the state police laboratory. It states that a member of the attorney general's office went back to the store in January, still seeing advertisements for Delta-8 products and even a sign saying they were giving away free samples of it. A search warrant was served just a few days later, taking over 550 items from the store. Online court documents show Brian was arraigned February 20th, and a preliminary hearing is scheduled for Thursday afternoon. Brian is facing a felony drug charge of manufacture, delivery, or possession with intent to manufacture or deliver, along with two smaller drug charges. Reporting, I'm Brock Owens. Thanks for watching the WJAC YouTube channel. For more top stories and breaking news, be sure to subscribe to this channel and download our news app.